Stratified random sampling allows the user to draw a random sample, yet consider the size of the amounts. In essence, it balances impartiality with materiality. In IDEA 10.3, an update has been made to the Stratify random sample feature that lets the user enter the percentage of records uh, to include within each strata instead of just entering a number. This makes the process of selecting a sample more effective, especially since populations can vary in size from period to period. So in this example, we're going to select numeric stratification. And as in the previous uh, version, we select the field to stratify and to total on. In this example, we'll select dollars for both. Here I'm going to uh, select the increment that I want to use to build my strata. So I'm going to choose 50,000. And for the upper limit, it'll be a clean 50. And I'll continue building the various bands. Let's take the 200,000. I'm going to change my increment to 100,000 and repeat the process. Uh, at 500,000, I will make the increment 500,000. And I'll continue going through until I get to two uh, million dollars. So I'm going to remove this. So now I've got 10 strata, 10 bands. And when I click on OK, what is new in 10.3 is this column over here, the percentage column. So in the past, uh, the auditor would enter the number of items that they want to see for each strata. So between 416 to 50,000, you can pick uh, five items. But what happened was, that when they wanted to, let's say, reperform this type of sample uh, on, a, on the same database in a future period, those distributions would change. So um, what we did now is we have created this percentage column where we can now, instead of entering a value, we can enter a percentage. And that percentage can be applied to that sample in future periods. So for example, for this stratum, we can say, well, we want to pick, uh, let's say, half a percentage, and it'll give us nine items. For this stratum, we can pick, let's say, 1%, gives us 13. If we go to the bottom here, there is one item over 2 million. So that's a high value item, and we want to pick 100% of all items that fall within that strata. So we get one item. From let's say 400 to 500,000, we can pick 10% of those items. That'll give us three. And here we can pick 5% within that strata. So here we have 31 items. As you can see, even though I entered 5%, it snapped it to the closest value to give us a whole number. So five items. 4.95%. And now I can go ahead and execute this sample. So now I've got 31 items. And if we were to index this database, you can see that it has accounted for some high dollar items that I wanted it to include in the sample, but still has retained uh, the fact that it's a random sample, taking into consideration high dollar items. So this is stratified random sample with this new column that allows the user to input percentages in addition to also inputting the amounts that they want to uh, have within each strata. Thank you.